Okay, so I guess I do YouTube now. I don't know. First day, I don't know. I'm never gonna do one of these kids. So. Um, but I just have to do this like everywhere I can because I need this dude like locked up, bro. Um, so this takes place in Pittsfield, Mass. Um, I was driving with my cousin, my cousin's friend, and this guy named Will Ledgeman. Um, last name is pronounced Ledgeman, spelled L-E-J-M-A-N. Um, you know, um, and so we were driving. Um, we got food. I got my check that day, a $2,500 check. So I cashed it in front of him. Put the money in an envelope in my glove box in front of him. Um, I bought him food. I felt bad. This kid is apparently homeless. I believed him. He might be. I don't know. Um, but I, I bought him food. And, um, I, I bought him food. I, I, you know, I bought him beer. I bought him bud and shit. And, you know, you know, we, we smoked, we drank together, and then, you know, we jammed out to music together, and, you know, he, he was kind of flirting with me, I was kind of catching feelings, to be honest, um, he, you know, he, he was hugging on me, he was giving me his jacket, he was, he was, um, when I was cold, he gave me his jacket, he was smiling, he was, like, touching me and stuff, he, he, um, you know, he, um, you know, he act, just acted like he liked me, you know, stupid me, I guess. Um, and then um, I stopped by Cumberland Farms, which in Massachusetts, at least, it's a um, convenience slash gas station. Um, I had to go to the bathroom and this is during the coronavirus time. So the bathroom was like one per person. So I had to go get the key. I got the key, went to the bathroom come out and apparently he had left my cousin goes oh will left i said okay bye will walked out of my car which by the way was unlocked stupid me um and i me my cousin and my cousin's friend take off we were going down west to the tonic street when i realized you know i'm on 45 miles i need to get gas and so why didn't i get gas at Cumbies? i don't know so i um I, again, I think. So I said to her, can you hand me a 20 out of the glove box? She goes, what do you mean? I said, there's money in the glove box. And she goes, what do you mean? I, I, I pull over and all the money's gone. I just broke down. I started crying. Like I couldn't deal with anything. I had, I had bills to pay. I had everything. Man. Like, I had. I had, I had everything, man. I had to pay bills. I had to pay people. I had, you know, so I cried and cried and cried. And after that, I just took my credit card, which was the only thing I had. And I can't even pay that off now. I took it and I went to, went to the shell station down the road, um, got gas. And then, um, my dumbass decided to report to the Pittsfield police. Um... That night, they didn't do anything. They took down his name, got a photo, and said he'd, they'd call me. Um, funny thing is, when I tried calling them back the next day, the cop that gave me his number didn't answer, like, four or five times. So, um, I went out looking for this kid myself. And, um, I found him. I found the kid. So... I pull up on the fucking sidewalk because at this point I'm pissed off. I pull up on the sidewalk. I get out. My cousin's still in the back. The door wide open. And I pull up on him and I said, you think I'm fucking with you? You think I'm fucking with you? $1,600? You think I'm fucking with you? And then he turns around and he goes, oh, shut up. Da, 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 da. I got in the lockup because you lied about me taking your money. I said, I would never lie. I, st I, I liked you. Why would I lie about you stealing my money? It's not in there, bro. You're the only one in the front seat. Um... And then a little cop comes around the corner, a traffic cop. And he goes, hey, 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 what's going on? What's going on? And I just started crying like I, like a big pussy, like, 
I don't know if I, I can't even say that on YouTube, but you know, fuck it. I'm not looking for monetization. Um, you know, and you know, I just cried and cried and cried, and all the time the kid's standing there just looking at me. And he, the kid got closer to me. I said, back off, bro. The cop was, he wasn't even doing anything. He got closer and closer to me. I said, back off. Like, trying to console me. Like, trying to be like, oh, it's okay, it's okay. I told him to back off, back off. He didn't. So, I slapped him across his fucking face. I slapped him. And the cop throws me up against a fucking fence. Took my hand behind my back. And I'm like, bro. Like, I didn't pull away because I'm not stupid. Like, I'm going to do what a cop tells me to do. Even if I don't like it. I, I did it, you know, I almost got arrested, I didn't, thank God, but, so my cousin takes the car, she pulls up, she parks, she got out, she, she, she runs up to the cop, she goes, whoa, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, and so, and they were, they were, they weren't rude to the cop, they were, they were saying stuff like, oh, do your job, do your job, and I was getting upset, because like, you know what, don't talk to an officer like that, you don't, you don't talk to police like that, man, like, not only because they can shoot you, they can shoot you, by the way. Um, not just out of the blue, obviously, but they, you know, they have guns. Um, I said, you know what? Start with respect. This this guy didn't, this cop didn't do anything to me. I'm the one who acted out. I'll be honest for, about that. I acted out. But in my opinion, I had a justified reason to. I had a justified reason to hit this dude. And so the cop let him go. And I just couldn't deal with it. I started, I started breaking down. I just, I didn't even go home that night. I just stayed out at my friend's house, at my cousin's house, up over her house. And I just cried and cried and cried and cried. I'm not even done crying because I'm starting to cry now. Um, I like this guy and he stole from me. Um, just, 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 um. Just a PSA, don't ever, first of all, don't ever leave any money in your car. Mm-hmm. And second of all, don't ever trust no bitch. Unless you, like, unless they're blood or, um, like, you know, you can trust them. Like, you've known them forever. Because this guy I've only known him for a week. And, you know, it's sad that I started catching feelings for him after a week. But, what you gonna do but... Your heart, man, right? Well, I don't even know if I liked him. Like, like, liked, but, you know, it's whatever. It happened. Just sharing my story because shit happens, man. Um, Just be aware of that shit, man. There's con artists all over, man.